know that a lot of the apps that you use that show you what your credit score is, it's actually showing you your consumer credit score. And there is more than one credit score. We know there's three bureaus, but there's also different credit scores. Your consumer score is what's used when you go to buy a vehicle. Your mortgage FICO is what's used when you go to buy a home. And it's almost always lower because it's scored on a more conservative system. When you're working on your credit, you really need to talk to a professional who can help guide you because it is not logical. So paying a card completely off most of the time will make your score come down, not up. I can help you navigate through what's good and what might not be good as far as getting your score up. But just so that you're aware of some of the things that affect your score the most, number one is utilization. So if your max on all your credit cards is $20,000, you want to keep the utilization of that at 4,000 or less. The other thing is making on time payments. So collections and things like that are actually one of the more challenging things to work through because it's so time based. But I have some tools that I can direct you to to help with that as well. Utilization is super easy. The other thing is longevity. So if you open a credit card, you know, 20 years ago, keep that one open, pay it on time. But having it open for a long time is really good. It shows that you're trustworthy. You can have access to credit and not overspend. That's kind of one of the, the things that they look at. So those are just a few.